Hey guys, I'm doing a VR to the Sonoran Desert Prepper giveaway. He asked me to uh, say a few things in this VR and I will show the, my new garden area here after I finish talking. Um, I just moved into this apartment. That was uh, one of the biggest things I asked the, the apartment owner was if I could have a, a a garden because this is out in the country and he said yeah no problem he said that uh, one of the previous uh, tenants had a very big garden so I know I can have probably at least an acre if I wanted it I mean that'd be a lot of work to try and take care of but um, Sonoran Desert Prepper also said that uh, what I would do if uh, the government started regulating growing your own garden, growing your own food. Um, if it came to that, I would probably hide it in the woods. Not one big garden, but small gardens. Little one here, little one there. Um, I've seen it done before on another video, I can't remember where, but this guy hid his gardens in the woods, just little gardens, and then kind of put brush around them to keep the animals away. and his gardens did okay so that's what I would probably do there if the government wanted to regulate it and try to charge me for growing my own food um, he also said to do a couple of shout outs which I will put in the video description at the bottom after the video and I wanted to do one from a, a friend in California a guy that helped do the cleanup that I was in which I didn't get to record because I was sick the whole day but I still picked up trash and he's got some good hiking videos and he doesn't have a lot of subscribers and his name is Jason Huckaba I will put his, uh, I hope I pronounced that right I'll put his link in the bottom, I'll put all these links in the bottom um, another one is a guy that's got some videos but he doesn't have a lot of subscribers and it's Lo Yesa, I don't know, I can't pronounce it um, I'll put that down there and then another one I want to do, another shout out, is for Northwest Nature Calls. And their link will also be in the video description. So I'm really excited about getting into this apartment. Um, I couldn't get my, my garden started, obviously, because I just got the apartment today. And it's supposed to be down below freezing tomorrow night anyway, so it's probably a good thing. I'll start some seeds inside here over the next week, probably. and. Uh, waiting probably a few more weeks before I plant them outside. I mean, I'll be living in Frankfort, Kentucky, which is uh, about, well, my apartment is about 25 miles from where I'm at now. It's in a, like a ranch style farmhouse kind of. I'm out near the horse farms, cow farms, out in the country, so I've got lots of woods to explore, um, lots of room to go out with a metal detector and see what I find, so there's a lot of cool, fun videos coming up. So we will get this video online, and like I said, this again is for the Sonoran Desert Prepper. I will put his link in the, in the description also. Thanks, guys. Well, guys, this is going to be the, uh, my new garden. I just moved into my new apartment here in Kentucky, and the landlord said I can have a garden out here. So uh, this is where I'm going to be having my new garden. I'll be right in here. It's a good thing I haven't got it started yet because it's supposed to get down in the 20s tomorrow night and in the low 30s tonight. Got a nice big backyard. Really going to be nice. We've got a two bedroom apartment out here in the middle of the country. This horse country out here, pretty much. You can see the fencing over there. So, we've got a two bedroom apartment, one and a half bath. For 500 a month, pretty nice. Back out in the country where I want, where I want to be. This is my neighborhood. So I was decided I'd do this VR to get in this contest for the seeds, and now I can have a garden to plant them. So just kind of wanted to give you guys a look around. This is my apartment right here in the front of this house. Somebody else has the back half. It's a 
not too bad. Um, needs some work, but the landlord's paying me to work on it. And since I haven't started my job yet, it uh, kind of works out nice. Probably going to dig up them roots right there and uh, put in some flowers or something. Who knows? Maybe another small garden here. Keep me from digging up all the turf in the back. We'll see what happens. But uh, it's a pretty nice place. So, like I said, two bedroom, one and a half bath, $500 a month. And this is my the countryside that I get to wake up to every morning. Just kind of wanted to give you guys a, a little look around and show you where my garden's gonna be. Just left uh, my new apartment and uh, on my way back to Lexington for the night, which I couldn't have got it in a better time because uh, my motel room is paid up just until tomorrow morning. So it worked out really nice. Um, the apartment needs some work, but the landlord's paying me to help him fix it up. $10 an hour just to paint and help him put down some flooring and stuff. And he's going to take it off next month's rent, so my next month's rent will probably be free. Um, I'm not too far from Frankfurt, a little ways out of town, but it's out in the country, and that's what I wanted. I hate living in the city, and being out here really nice like I said it's pretty much all horse farms around um, I'm not too far from the Kentucky River so I could probably go down there and do some fishing um, I asked the landlord if there was any lakes around and he said there is but there's probably like an hour away and I know the Kentucky River ain't but probably not even 10 minutes away but look at all these woods out here guys just down the road from the house, I can come down here and do some hiking around. There's no houses right through this area here, none at all. No driveways for probably almost a mile. Just one here, one there, but I mean, hardly nothing. So, real nice stretch of woods out here, and uh, yeah, it's gonna be nice.